So. <laughs> mm. Very mystic. You cannot see my eyes. Cuckook. <laughs> oh, no. My people out there, welcome to this channel once again. Today with a question, can talismans make you ill? Yes. I have been working on a talisman. And I'm pretty much always on a detox program. So I take my, stu take my stuff. Maybe I tell you once when, uh, what, but for now I think... It's not necessary, not necessary because there's so many information and I'm not a medical doctor. So, the point is yes, talismans can make you sick. It is not as bad as maybe in the film Exorcism, like you gonna turn your head and... <laughs> At least not when you start. And when you do something like this, you will be like... Yeah, hand will be trembling before this even happens. So you will not even be able to write a talisman or make a program, yes. But if you happen to get a talisman ready and it is maybe too strong for you... So I had this story, yes, once, with someone who ordered something. Um, if you happen to make something, yes. Then you just uh, stay away. Yes, you keep it, you see, oh, it's making me sick. Okay, put it far away. If it's too bad, of course, bring it even farer. But my thing would be like this. Put it somewhere in the corner in the kitchen. <laughs> Or something and then after one month you can come back you feel better and things like this so so I needed to make a break from writing this talisman because the more I wrote the sicker I got so it's like a flu yes and I will also write what this talisman is because it is Alhamdulillah one of my best inspirations so far so I started on the last video, maybe I will link it below, for uh, Talisman for Love, yes. And this is because it's white, what people could say, white spirituality, white magic, but it's not magic, it's anti-magic. It's, it's about destroying the blockages, yes. What I was going to say, yes. This is the first time for me making on a slight fever a video in a very mystical way. <laughs> <laughs> and maybe people like it, I don't know. Yeah, so I stopped. And it's about it's three talismans. I had another video where I talk about the real seal of Solomon, alayhi salam, which was gave to me by a Murid in Larnaca. Who knew it somehow? Yes, how it looks like. Maybe I also put the link in the description below. Otherwise, write Real Seal of Solomon, inshallah. Uh, and then you can add up, add up, add up. So here we go. This art and science is about mixing stuff also, right? Not too much. Just go with the thing that your heart is happy with yes and if you say numerology and stuff like this is haram yes you see a link in the this is for sure i put it every time a link of a video where i talk about the banner of the prophet sallallahu alayhi wasallam where you can find uh, magical what they call magic squares yeah with abjad numbers up here you see it i am here very professional now have it to my side at the beginning people were saying yeah this is not good you are pointing, these people who point to say this, you are pointing to the banner of the most exalted Prophet Sallallahu Ta'ala Alaihi Wa Alihi Wa Sahbihi Wa Sallam. Sorry for the show. I am nothing. 
just writing this quest because I like it and it came to me some books yes but yes you can get sick especially if yes a lot of transformation can happen yeah 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 yeah, yeah. so just lie down take a break let's see how I can how I continue but I will do this uh, topic also on this very strong talisman and when it's ready inshallah because I put there a seal with which the Ottomans used to conquer cities <laughs> and I didn't even have wrote this and it's already putting me down <laughs> because I added also there is a seal from Dulkarnain it was its banner it was like a 16 pointed but I will 16 pointed sun I will talk in the next video about this inshallah yes so just as a reminder when things are too heavy on you put them away make a break be it a practice but have the intention to come back yes and do as much as you can yes like take the bow as strong as you can but be reasonable that the bow doesn't break so because people say also maybe multiple talismans they will or also stones they will interact it's a question of interpretation yes of course they can overcharge someone but yeah maybe this are what uh, this is what we are here for yes yeah so i i wrote i read in a chishti book the sufi practice of healing by chishti the sufi chishti order it's pretty famous that there are certain things when it's given to someone who is not ready for it it's like putting a injection yes like a injection that is so big as yeah transport or a transport ship like these big ones <laughs> yes where you put a lot of things good things bad things yeah cows they put i don't know crazy right they put cows they put oil they put gold and maybe gold not but crazy stuff going on anyhow this you inject this big thing into a mosquito this but yes uh, you will not get it <laughs> usually yes it, alhamdulillah allah is merciful and he will hide it from you and even if you approach it from far you will be blocked like pff, things will happen that and if you still go then it might happen like for ataturk <laughs> maulana used to say this right Uh, Ataturk went into the top Kapisarai where he wanted to get out the banner of the Prophet which contains probably the squares and he got a slap <laughs> because no one is allowed and people know it and the wazirs they told him that don't do it <laughs> no good idea <laughs> but he went yeah fever is sometimes quite good it makes you a little bit drunk maybe yeah Drunk from Ishk, inshallah. Yes, and then he had like his face totally on, yeah, on the one side, like this fish, which has the face on one side up. Yes, this was his form then, and he said, "Oh, now I cannot go to this." Um, To my other people because they will laugh at me they will say you are cursed and stuff like that yes he is cursed and then they said what can we do what can we do and then one wizir or parliamentarian back then i think uh... <laughs> we are so crazy here uh, imitating people <laughs> who knows the one knows <laughs> but it was not on purpose 
<laughs> Bismillahirrahmanirrahim. So he went to one of his parliamentarians and he said, yes. And how will I get straight face again, like a normal fish now, our back? <laughs> yeah, you know, this fish which lives in the sands, it is like flipped face. Maybe I show it, I don't know. I'm too always too lazy to put pictures in here. But let's see. I'm improving on this topic. <laughs> so funny talk, not so practical today. Just be cautious, yes. Don't go underground in the top copy set, I no. Otherwise, yeah, you can try your things, but keep a good intention. I'm talking to myself first. Subhanallah. Yeah, so he's this one parliamentarian he said Please, please, please you have to go to the Sufi saint he lives somewhere in like the Turkish desert or savannah or what what not, yes. <laughs> so they went and this one may, may open the door and he said, Oh yes, I waited for you. But you I'm sorry if I put something wrong, but people who know the story may correct me. But it's the meaning is here for being um yes metaphorical whatever, yes. And he said, Yes, you have to say Toba Stafrila before I so Allah forgive me before I help you. And he said No, I'm not going to say. And the Sufi saint, he said, yes, please say it. He said, no, 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 no. So this went back like this and this. And then one of the parliamentarians said, yes, please say it doesn't matter. You need to have a straight face to continue your work. Okay, I say stuff. Uh, yes. So the Sufi saint, he took one of his flip flops and from the other side, and he made a backflip and lay on the ground and then the parliamentarians here they came and said to him oh it's straight again maybe a little red but again straight yes so yes you might need professional help then yeah you see and then he could go back and everything was alhamdulillah okay so there is always a solution also and yes keep mystical wait for the next video where i share the ottoman talisman for conquering a city just in case you want to conquer a city <laughs> usually not right me i don't want i'm just making here a show yes even it gets darker and darker, right? So like, subscribe, read the description below if you want to have contact. What was Maulana, Maulana again saying? Take rest. Take rest. Very important in these times. SubhanAllah. May Allah forgive me and guide us all and forgive us all <laughs> drunken dervish show with fever in the red light district welcome don't get sick keep healthy this is the most important thing salams <laughs>